Hi and welcome to the session. I am Kanika and I am going to help you to solve the following question. The question says, show that the following argument is valid. S1 is P or Q, S2 is negation of P and S is Q. Let's now start the solution. We will first construct a truth table for all hypotheses and conclusion. In this question, two hypotheses are given to us. First hypothesis is P or Q and second one is negation of P. And the conclusion is Q. So let's make a truth table for P or Q, negation of P and Q. Let P has truth value T, T, F, F. Let Q has truth value T, F, T, F. Now we will find the truth value of both the hypothesis. First hypothesis is P or Q. So let's first find the truth value of P or Q. When both P and Q has truth value T, then P or Q has truth value T. When P has truth value T and Q has truth value F, then P or Q has truth value T. When P has truth value F, Q has truth value T, then P or Q has truth value T. When both P and Q has truth value F, then P or Q has truth value F. Now we will find the truth value of negation of P. When P has truth value T, then negation of P has truth value F. When P has truth value F, then negation of P has truth value T. Now we will find the truth value of the conclusion. Truth here, the conclusion is Q. So truth value of Q is T, F, T, F. Now we will find the critical rows. Critical rows are those rows in which the hypotheses are true. Only in the third row, the hypotheses are true. Now we will see whether the conclusion is true or not in this critical row. Conclusion is also true in this critical row. So this means that the given argument is valid. So there is only one critical row in which the conclusion is also true. Hence, the given argument is valid. This completes the session. Bye and take care.